Hey, it's Allison with Nurturing Readers. We have some great new nonfiction titles that will keep your kids learning. So let's start with the little ones. We now have Usborne Very First Words Library, Garden, and Farm. These are great new additions. This one's gonna teach your kids all about the different animals on the farm, as well as the sounds they make and different vocabulary. I also love that there's a chick in each of the peepholes as your kids turn the pages. How fun is that? One of our favorite new series is called Animal Magic. This is absolutely awesome. We have In the Jungle and In the Ocean. Let me show you how this works. When you flip the pages, the pictures change. So your kids are going to just have so much fun flipping through this one. It is absolutely awesome. We read that one again and again. Okay, we now have new ones in our Big Words for Little People series. We have Celebrate, Our World, Learning, and now we have Respect, which is my favorite. I love that my kids get to learn about this word. There's different words in here like Accept, Treat, Polite, Fairness. Really helps your kids learn the concept of respect. This is great for ages four and up. Did you know Usborne Books and More is known for their flat books? And we have lots of new ones all for all different ages. Usborne Peek Inside series is great for toddlers. This is Peek Inside a Bird's Nest. These flaps are a little thicker, so we know our little ones can be rougher on books, but they're gonna learn all about bird's nest and there's a QR code so they can actually see a live bird's nest as well. Here's a great one if your kid struggles to go to bed. Why do I have to go to bed? It's gonna answer all their questions surrounding that. Um, this is also good for toddlers. And it's really going to lay out all the ins and outs like why they're, you should take a nap and what are some good bedtime tips to help you fall asleep. We also have a good one for the little ones about why should I share? This is a hard concept for them, right? But there's lots of flaps in here to lay out all the ins and outs of why it's important. Like, do I have to share with my brother? I know I've gotten that question. And yeah, and this is why it is really good for you. So I love um, that sharing can not only help us, but help the world. So many good concepts in this one. We also have Lift the Flap, questions and answers about feelings. What a good book to have on hand. I am a school social worker, so I absolutely love this book and how it's laid out. Like, for example, is it wrong to feel annoyed? No, there's no such thing as a wrong feeling, even if it doesn't feel very nice. And I love just all the questions in here, like, why don't I like being teased? Why do I feel sleepy? And then at the back, there's even a feelings wheel to help you have even more discussions with your child and talk about how you can even have multiple feelings at the same time. I love this new one for our older readers, Lift the Flap Trees. Um, I love that flaps help kids retain information. You can see in this one, there's lots more flaps for our older readers. It's also in bite-sized chunk. So if you have a reluctant reader, this one is perfect for them. Do you have a young kiddo who's into computers? Well, here's a great new series for you. This is First Steps in Coding. We have all different ones in here. Um, and what's great is these are a really good deal, $24.99 for six books. And you can really start your kid young, ages, this is for ages three and up, because these are storybooks. And it's a coding introduction where your kids get to join the robots along the way as they learn different things, like this one's What's a Variable, a story of time adventure. Now, do you have a kid who's into engineering? We have those because my husband's an engineer. Um, this is kid engineer working with buildings and structures. We've got computers and robots, energy, and we've got machines and materials. And then last but not least, transport. This is a hands-on approach and an intro into engineering. There's simple step-by-step -step projects in here, six books, great for ages nine and up. We are loving this new series. Usborn has two new titles that are in our magazine style, which is so engaging to our older readers. We now have lots of things to know about animals. So if you have an animal lover, this one is great. It has fun things like, why do pandas do handstands? Why horses sometimes dress like zebras? And even how to spot a leopard from a jaguar. This is great for ages six and up. Now we have a new one in our understanding series. This is understanding physics. This series takes really complicated concepts and breaks them down in a really good way for our kiddos. This physics is a study of the universe and everything in it. So this book is gonna dive into some of 
the world's biggest questions and your kids are going to discover what is still left to be known. This is a great book for ages 10 and up.